Hey, I'm the Highway Walker and today we're going to look at storing your seeds. What kind of seeds should you store? How long will they store? What are the best ways to store them? One of the best ways is in the freezer. Make sure that the humidity stays away from your seeds. Storing them in Ziploc bags and jars, whatever it needs to happen. You want to store non-GMO, meaning they're not genetically modified by human beings. We want just the God-given seeds that we all have grown and we've done well until we start messing around with this kind of stuff. We want to make sure that they are organic and they are not modified. So these are things that we're going to look at today and one of the ways to store them so that you can have long term, 5 to 20 years they'll store if done correctly. And that's what we want to do today. Yeah. Now we're going to try to do some seeds. <laughs> okay, this with our fun. fruit saver. I love my little yeah. saver. This is such fun. We're going to put the whole packet in because that gives information, all kinds of stuff. And uh, we'll see if that uh, sucks the air out of there good. And also it'll definitely keep them dry. This paper will not protect from moisture and other things, so this will give it more protection for long-term storage. Same thing, I cut it out. They do have bags that you can um, use that are already cut and everything, but if you have small little items like we're doing with the pills and the seeds, this makes it nice where you make your own size. Yes, and it's more economical too. Yeah, and they're a lot less expensive. But. And yeah, there. Okay. And seal. Okay. Put those in there. Like so. And seal those. And then you can stick these in the freezer. And so voila. How'd, how'd that work? Well, it's sucked in there good. You can definitely see no extra moisture. And it's sucked up pretty tight. You can feel. Awesome. So I think it's all right to leave them in the paper. It sucked it pretty good. Even got it out of the paper. Okay, awesome. That way you have what the seed is, the instructions and everything, yeah. and the year that you put it in there. So it's all there for you with the package. Right, and then also you can mark on here anything you want to write. Exactly. But right now everything is pretty much there that you need. And these are the non-GMO and non-hybrid seeds. And make sure if you're going to store long-term seeds that they have to be non-GMO and non-hybrid. You want to keep these in a cool dry place or you can even put them in the freezer and they'll extend the shelf life. So we're hoping by putting them in our, using our food saver, we'll even get more uh, shelf life out of these because there'll be no oxygen or moisture reaching them. That is what you need. Long life. Long life for storage purposes. All right. There we are, stored and ready. So we have seeds and some medicines for long-term survival.